model for me, Mrs. Kensington. You know how Mr. Kensington feels about that. Oh, behave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, baby. <laughs> yeah. So, today we're talking about your board breaks. And um, I actually want to specifically talk about momentum into your board breaks. So, momentum is how fast you're going toward something and through something, okay? So, we're actually going to talk about impulsive momentum. So whenever you hit this, guys, you're hitting the board. If my hand is the board and I hit it like a high five, what happened? It stopped because I'm applying the same amount of force for my hand that the board has. All right, and so they're just stopping. I have to give more from this hand through this board. So I need to be able to push past the board that's in the way. So guys, when we're doing this drill, when you're practicing your breaks, um, let's say we had a palm heel and my board is where this hand is here. I have to aim past the board. My goal needs to be hitting a target here, not the board itself. Otherwise, that's where we come with that high five and that slap. We need to hit all the way through it. So instead, we need to go through, whereas my board break was right here, my hand is aiming for past. So I have to set myself up to that position. So as you're drilling your boards today, I want you to work speed, acceleration, and add the force behind it so you can get the momentum to go through this board, guys. This is how I break through multiple boards or bricks at a time is because whenever I'm hitting it, it just goes, 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 goes because I'm applying more than the boards are resisting. So guys, that's what we're going to work on today is we're going to work your uh, momentum into your board break. So again, you're here and you're going to go through, boom, past that board break for each one of your drills. So we're going to pull up here and break down what your drill should look like. Okay, guys, you got this. Does that sound okay? That's good. Does that sound like a all right, brown advance belt to black um, belts with a blue stripe. You have a choice, advanced choice. So what that means, guys, is you're going to be working from, you have to have one hand and one leg or one upper body and one lower body drill to be able to break. So as you're practicing, you can need to practice by first watching one of our lower belt uh, videos, any of the green through um, brown because they're gonna show us what we're really focusing on today, which is momentum, and how we're gonna apply this momentum, guys. And then um, I want you to go drill and practice your board breaks uh, outside on a tree with a parent, holding a pillow, holding a suitcase, holding something, or your siblings working together. Make sure you're working on your aim. Uh, during one of these videos, I accidentally kicked Miss Lily and she's not very happy with me. So don't let your parents get unhappy with you because you're stuck in a house with them. So <laughs> it's going to be good. Guys, work really hard for us. We want to see your videos and what you're posting, okay? You got this. <laughs> All right, take one arm across, stretching out the shoulders from that arm workout earlier. Good job. And take your other arm across, stretching out that arm, stretching your shoulders. Take one arm over and behind your head, pressing it down. Go ahead, switch arms for me. Press that arm down and behind your head. Here's a tricky one. Go ahead, lace your fingers behind your back. 
And now you're gonna try and get them up as high as you can. If you can touch your head to the floor and bring those arms as far forward as you can without bending your elbows. That's awesome. Way to go, guys.